hello guys welcome back to my channel such as my text electronics don't forget to hit the like button subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified when i upload the next video thank you always stay updated so guys how are you guys doing today hope you guys are fine holy shit right now i don't really feel that good man i don't feel real good I feel fine uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to flash this phone this is it's LP32 it's LP32 MTK device at first the phone stopped on both logo when switching on then after some time the phone didn't switch on again because of that I know the phone is soft break so uh, I'm going to show you guys how to to flash it step by step how to to recover the phone from dirt boot so before we start there is something i want to tell you guys this is mtk device and the good news in this is that all the way i'm going to show you guys is all is the same way that you are going to flash any mtk device you are not going to go around checking on another way to flash an mtk device it's a universal universal way to flash all the phones it's a universal way to flash all MTK device. So let's get started. First, you will need to download the flash file. You will need to go download the flash file. Be careful not to download the wrong file for the phone. If not, you will kill one phone one day. <laughs> At that time, you're gonna be real serious, following serious in one shot with a customer. Man. That's really gonna be hellacious you know about that so before we get started so here we go the first thing you will need right now is the firmware the flash the flash file in which you need to install in the phone then second let me show you the, the flash file that I downloaded you are going to find it this is it right here sorry not this one yeah this one I'm going to extract it you just need to hold on for it to finish it takes a lot of time depending depending on the size if the size is small it won't take time well guys as you can see it's done extracting so what you will need to do now is to find the extracted folder Pull it in. Let me show you guys here. Yeah. <laughs> what you need right now, you need this scattered file, which is this. So, the second thing you will need the flash tool. You can use SP flash tool, MTK Miracle to flash, or any MTK box that you have to flash your tool. So, I'm going to use SP flash tool. You go ahead, open it. Then click here, choose scatter loading file you're going, you're going to choose here. Then go to the folder in which you extracted. So I'm going to go there right now. Click, enter, then click the scattered file. Well, so you need to take note of this preloader if the phone still switch on like it switch then stock in boot logo or it switch enter in uh, it switch directly to the uh, recovery mode or reboot you will need to deselect the preloader so right now the phone doesn't switch on at all I'm going to leave the preloader pre like that I'm not going to deselect it what you will need to do now is to go ahead right now going to click format all and download but for you to deselect the, the preloader you can't do format all 
you see when you deselect it it shows only download only so I'm going to click format all because the phone doesn't switch on at all yeah click download insert your USB cable to your computer to your laptop press the boot key before you connect the, the USB cable to the phone it might be the volume up or the volume down for, but for this one it's the volume up I'm going to go ahead press the volume up button connect As you can see this the flashing process have started right now you just need to sit back and watch you need to sit back right now and watch you don't need to disconnect the USB cable if the phone switch on was switching on then you flash and disconnect the USB cable surely you are going to enter in deep show man won't switch on again until you flash it back but at times you will need to reprogram the EMMC because when it fail like that it mismatch the file some files won't won't be in the direct places in which they were <coughs> directed to be because of that the phone won't switch on and won't permit any firmware so that so because of that you will need to reprogram the EMMC before you flash it so always take note of your laptop or not to shake the USB cable during fr flashing process <laughs> as you can see the flashing is going you need to do nothing right now you just need to sit and watch you just need to sit, sit and watch <laughs> As you can see guys now the flash is done so we we so we are going to see if the phone works now or not As you can see right now it shows okay we are going to go ahead check the phone if it switches on or still does not switch <coughs> 